game, the Louisville game, and then uh, tried to get to bed, so I wasn't up too late. Probably like one. One? Yeah. My energy had cooled off. Yeah. Did it take time to kind of calm down, to settle down after that, to, to get back out here today? I mean a little bit, you know, uh, we uh, really battled that, and you know, our energy was really high, so you know, it's hard to cool down after a game like that, but you know, we had to do it, you know, we had to get some rest, we were, I had to I had to lay down and get our feet up. You know, we got a quick turnaround here. So, mm -hmm. you guys have gone through this it's the third straight year. You won the first game. You haven't won the second game. What what have you learned anything about you know, from those previous experiences to take into? Yeah, you know, you can't you can't just think that you're gonna win the two games in a row. You know, you have to come out and you have to give it your all every every single night. You know, you can't you can't take a night off. And I think uh, I think the guys know that. And, and, you know, we're, we're building up really well right now. So. How, how, big would, how big would it be to, to win that second game, to get to the Sweet 16, something this program has never done? It'd be, it'd be huge, uh, but, you know, as we know we know what it takes. Um, you know, we, we know we know how much work we, we have to put in, and, you know, it's it's on us to do that, you know. So. And you got Louisville to face, which <laughs> makes it even harder. Yeah, they're, they're a great team, you know, but... Uh, they're beatable, you know. I think teams have proven that throughout the season. So you know, uh, so we, we we have a tough tough job to, ahead of us, but you know we can we can do it. When you're watching Manhattan play, take them to the wire yesterday. What is what do you what are you thinking during that uh, during that game? Um, you know, just you know, they're two great teams that are going at it. I, I mean, I. Didn't really look into. It. I was more concerned about their players and their plays and things like that. You know, uh, it's started scouting right after our game. So, mm -hmm. yeah. You had that. You had that three late in regulation that about yeah. two minutes ago that looked like it was going down and bounced and bounced out. And I think on the next possession, Dwayne has a layup that doesn't go in. At that point, are you guys thinking we're not? The, the breaks are going against us. Uh, no, you know, we, we thought we were getting good shots, you know, they just weren't falling and, uh, you know, if you keep getting good shots like that, they're going to eventually uh, eventually go down. I think I hit my neck for three, so, so you know, it, it full falls like that sometimes, you just got to keep playing for it. We've seen it throughout the season with the, the free throw shooting on this team. What was, anything, any common thread to everybody having a bad day yesterday? I, I don't really understand why it just happened, uh, you know, we, we pride ourselves on our free throws, so, you know, you know, we'll, we'll come out and fix that. So. What are you? Emotional win like that. How much do you guys think about Coach Jarrett? You know, he's always, he's always in the back of our minds. You know, uh, <coughs> it's fundamentals that he's taught us, the, the game that he taught us. Uh, you know, it's it's part of who we are. So, uh, you know, he's 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 there, but you know, you can't really think about him too much. Coach Godfrey last night after the game said you could just sort of see with, with your group being seniors, you know, knowing. That you lose and it's the end. Um, did you feel that at all as, as players? Yeah, I think uh, as a team, you know, we, we came together. We said we're not going out like this. You know, we're, we're not ending like this. And I think uh, I think that really uh, propelled us, gave us some energy to, to come back there. So. What has made this group such a unique, such a unique group? You know, it's just it's it's different in the in the team environment. You know, we're we're great friends. You know, I consider these guys my brothers. You know. Uh, some teams, you know, they don't really come together like that. I think I think we've come together really well. You know, we've we've become friends ever since we met four years ago. So, do, do, you, uh, do you remember at all the sort of when it felt like this group was clicked and sort of became what it became? Because obviously that first year was really tough. Yeah, the first year was really tough, but I think it helped us become who we were. Uh, you know, if you don't you don't if you don't feel the bad times, you're never gonna you're never gonna not want to do it again. So. I mean, going into that second year, did you guys know at that point that, that you were going to be this kind of team? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, going into that second year, we had confidence. You know, we we had a great off season that summer. I think uh, you know we 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 knew what we we knew what we had to do. You know, we we our freshman year, I don't think we closed out the games as well as we we should have. But you know, uh, we've learned a lot from those games. So.